Can be sexy and funny. Uh, and at number five today, <laughs> and at number five, girls in bikinis taking body shots off of each other. This is, this is gonna be fantastic. I mean, nothing could possibly go wrong, right? <laughs> so you're gonna do it all over my face. You gotta put my makeup in the pit. Your makeup looks like <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I've, I've actually had that shot oh, before. Yeah? That's the, uh, the the slippery neck brace. <laughs> I don't know. See, huh? I feel like you could have gone with Jaeger bomb. Well, that's kamikaze those would also like, have worked. Yeah. Lemon drop, another good one. Uh, okay, okay. How about uh, how about uh, sex on the hospital bed? <laughs> I would have stuck with mine. Okay, that works too. Yeah. Coming in at number four, see what happens when someone brings a quarter stick of dynamite to a pool party. All right, proving for perhaps the trillionth time that rednecks plus explosives equals pleasure. All right, put it in there. <laughs> well, you don't have a pool problem no more. Yeah, there are multiple problems with that pool. Yeah. I'd like to, all right, put it in there. It's a, <laughs> exactly what was said when he was conceived. It's just like the amount of class that you yeah. have in a family like that. Yeah, classy. Doesn't go far. Yeah. Afterwards, though, they did shoot up the bird, bat, bat, bird bath with uh, Grandpappy's old Civil War rifle. <laughs> and then they actually smashed the barbecue with a giant stick. Now, that is how you celebrate our country's independence, with uncontrolled violence. You know, like the first time. Yeah! Yay! We did it right. <laughs> Uh, today's number three item is an actual advertising campaign from the 80s. You guys stuff. remember the 80s, right? Yeah. There's a whole show and about that. And as you're that. about to see, this ad was either created by brilliantly juvenile pun masters. Or people in the 80s were just too hopped up on coke and Reaganomics to notice this stuff. <laughs> You've got your sunrise. You caught a prize. You, you're making your Johnson. Party nights, summer whites. You, your friends, and your Johnson. Rooster tails, water trails, you, your kids, and your Johnson. Saturday nights, distant lights, you, your girl, and your Johnson. You and your Johnson, a way of life for over 50 years. That commercial could be used as evidence in a court case. It most likely has been. Yeah. Yeah. I, the Johnson was the boat, right? I don't know. Okay. Coming in at number two, a video of a turtle that will change the way you think of nature's cutest salmonella carriers. Yeah, yeah. We know that, uh, you know, turtles are amphibious, yeah. right? But here's proof that they're actually home on any dance floor that's bumping the butt movingest groove ever, if I may. Benny Benassi's satisfaction. Shake that ass, turtle! <laughs> Push me. And then just touch me till I can get my satisfaction. 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 Yeah. Okay. Hey, Tiny Morgan. Hi, Kevin. How are you? I'm doing. I'm doing pretty okay. Yourself? Yeah. Oh, I'm Good. doing just fine. Yeah, I doing... like turtles. You know. I, I, who doesn't love turtles? That turtle liked to dance, so Tiny Morgan. What well, about he yourself? Sure, he surely did. He surely but, did. What about you, though? No, I don't much like dancing. No, I don't. I don't like it. What if? Uh, what if we had some music going, Tiny Morgan? What if we have a little? Can we get a little? Uh, little something? Ah, uh, how about yeah. now, Tiny Morgan? Yeah. I don't think so. I don't really feel much like dancing. There's a lot of people around, you know. Okay. Oh no, no, no. I, got... I understand. I understand. What if I ask my friend Mr. Toothbrush to join you on the dance floor? Well, I don't know. I've had that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's true. That's me. I knew it. 
It works on turtles and tiny Morgans. Yesterday's number one around the net has inspired today's number one around the net. It, yes. doesn't, it does not happen often, but when it does, it this happens. This is a special event, and we already saw the ecstatic reaction of YouTube user HungryBear9562 to a double rainbow. A double oh. rainbow. It, it was a double oh. rainbow. What does it mean? In his front yard. And thankfully, <laughs> it didn't take long for the internet to spool up its little meme engine. Yes. So first, the team behind Autotune the News, they put Hungry Bear's exclamations through their magic music machine, and they ended up with something that's actually kind of listenable. What does this mean? It's so bright, so vivid. Double rainbow, double rainbow. It's so dense, dense. What does this mean? It's starting to look like a triple rainbow. That's a whole rainbow now. Number one on iTunes. That's going to happen. And that's all well and good, Morgan. Right. But what if we like our mashups uh, a bit more danceable? So well, we can I don't know anybody out. who likes to dance. Oh. Um, but, but the internet will provide the answer anyway. Double oh my God. This is me. of our age. We did it. We did it, everybody. Proof that the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow is probably a tubby fella on peyote. Yeah. yeah. All right, so you get your daily viral fix. Check out all the viral videos we have to offer. Just go to g4tv.com slash around the net.